past weekend was the long weekend and we thought we would avoid the crowd so we just went to the museum and now we're gonna go to the garden we got the loaded wedges and the salmon quiche tart Wednesday, I just got done getting ready. We're about to head out. We're going out for dinner tonight. We are celebrating. Harry's cousin just recently graduated, so we're taking him out for dinner. We're going to a buffet. Um, it's called Eight Buffet, and they pretty much have like eight different cuisines at the buffet, so you're kind of traveling all around the world with that. I will show you what I got for my birthday this year now that I've seen most of my friends and family not everyone but the majority so I thought I would wrap things up and share with you what I got because I love watching this type of content I love seeing what other people got because it really does serve as a good gift guide because it was an actual gift so I have all my gifts that I have here my friends and family really do spoil me I'm so lucky and grateful I'll start off with what I got for myself I did unbox it in a previous vlog if you missed it I'll leave it up here but I did get the DJI pocket 2 in sunset white it's so cute so pretty I feel like every time like a new friend or family sees this they're like wow it's so cool it's so interesting and it is um, but I do have some mixed feelings about it I've been using it for almost a month and maybe I'll do like a mini TikTok review or something because yeah I don't know there are some things I wish I would have known maybe I just didn't do enough research I don't regret it some days I do but some days I don't but it's okay it's a gift I got for myself it's cute it's handy I will use it so that's what I got for myself first so this little bag is from my brother and his girlfriend they got me a couple things so the first thing here are these super cute gold butterfly studs from Pasco and they also got me the Chanel egg the hand cream I know Chanel's not cruelty free but I've always wanted this um, so I love it it's so cute gonna go straight into my handbag for sure and then they got me the Tatcha the dewy skin cream which is so pretty I think Tatcha's products are good it's just really expensive that I don't think it's worth it but as a gift like ah! has the spoon there as well love then from my mom got an ang bao, a red pocket. It's really hard for me to accept things from my parents when they give me gifts and stuff. I think if you're just a child of an immigrant, I think we all kind of struggle with that, right? I always want to purchase things with my own money. I've been like this ever since I was very young. I think when you just grow up watching your parents literally working seven days a week, um, yeah, you just you feel that type of way so it's really hard for me to accept this but I think it's more rude if you don't accept it I did already uh, spend it because <laughs> it was the long weekend and I got an electric blanket because it's getting cold here so that's what I got with the red bag I got an electric blanket and then I guess I'll move into this cutie thing so my friend she gift wrapped this so pretty I'll put a photo up here and it's just like a handy bag as well like I definitely will use this but the other gift she got me is the beauty fridge which I've actually always wanted one but I didn't know where to put it and I still don't know where to put it because it's like huge okay 
I haven't used any of my birthday gifts because I've been waiting to show you guys first. Ah! I love it. And then this guy here, my other friend, got me a foot spa. I'm so excited to use this. My feet are always cold and especially winter is coming. This is going to be so handy. We are all about self-care here. And then from Harry's brother and his wife, so like pretty much my brother and sister-in-law, they got me this from Walken Hall. It is a pearl necklace. It's like fresh pearls because the pearls are not like, you know, circle. It's like more... I don't know, like odd shape, if that makes sense. Um, but it's super cute. I'll show you the entire thing. And I like this one because a lot of the other pearl necklaces I have are a little bit bigger. This one just feels a little bit more casual. And then she got me a bunch of clothes as well. My sister-in-law always gives me so much clothes, like all the time. So this is the first piece, very Sung Jia, very Chanel. It's a pink tweed vest, love. I feel like everybody knows my style really well. Then we got this piece here. It's a little bit thinner knit, but this would be great. Love this color. And the next one is this jacket cardigan. It's super soft and like fuzzy. And then lastly, we have this brown coat. All of this is gonna come like so perfect for this winter season because it is getting a little bit colder here. I feel like not as cold. Next is from my friends Denise and Kadeen. They sent me a bunch of things. First sent over these wafers. Three different flavors. Have you guys tried this? I'm excited to dig in. And then they got me a gift card to Shein, which I haven't used yet. I'm thinking of maybe shopping on their like home section and get some decor stuff because it is a goal of mine to like furnish another room. I said I want to furnish the entire house by the end of the year, but I don't think that's going to be possible because we're already in June and I haven't done anything. So maybe I'll like look at some decor because I have enough clothes. But she did get me two tops from Shein. This first one here is like a houndstooth crop top. And then the next one is this cutie top with a sweetheart neckline with the pearls around the neckline. I love this one too. I haven't tried them on, but I'm sure they'll fit. And I'm excited to start putting everything into use because I was just kind of like stocking everything up in one corner because I wanted to gather everything and share it with you guys. But yeah, I should probably get back to filming now. This is the makeup look of the day. I am using the new Colourpop Mega Palette called Getting Fresh using their bronzers, their glosses. So this is look one. Um, you guys will see that but I do still have some TikToks to film, another YouTube video so I probably should get back to it. I got these confetti balloons because if you guys know that twice, Nyon is doing her comeback and she kind of did this transition thing on TikTok that I want to do. So this is like one of the looks which I do need to get changed. The sun is about to go down so I quickly need to do this. Got the outfit on. I actually quite like this outfit. I don't know. It's a vibe. It's a vibe. Well, okay. So this is the aftermath from filming that and this is the first look I need to film two more look popping balloons the mess gotta pack away all my birthday gifts there but this is just what I do for content really straight into my pajamas I'm using a new cleansing balm today this one's from 43 Beauty it's the Bloom Service Rose Cleansing Balm this is a little bit newer like it came out this year I don't love rose but I also don't hate it you really can't even smell it. So I'm just writing out my mom's birthday card. This is the one I got her for a lovely mom. Her birthday is actually in August, but I'm going to be giving this to her early because I decided for her birthday this year, I'm going to take her to Queenstown. It's going to be an all-inclusive trip paid by me. And we're just going to go for uh, three days. Yes, oh no, three nights, four days. Um, it'll be my mom, me, and Harry, the three of us, the three musketeers. I think my mom just wants to spend time with me, and especially like I don't live with her anymore, and I'm not like, I'm not like the best daughter. Um, I don't see her that often. I think this year though, I have definitely tried my best to see her more. It's just that me and my mom, we have very opposite personalities. Like we're very, very opposite. I feel like when I was younger, when I was with her, we would I would always be like yelling at her. Not like yelling, like we'd just always be like raising our voice at each other. Like we couldn't just have like a normal conversation without like nagging. And although the nagging, you know, is still there, of course. 
um, I just feel like we're civil, you know, we can get along, we can have a normal conversation at a normal tone. So it's just about like an hour and a half plane ride. So that's okay for her. We already booked the tickets. I booked the hotel a few nights ago and I did book like quite a nice hotel um, because I just wanted to spoil my mom a little bit. I don't know, I just feel like again what I was saying earlier when I was showing you the red bag that she gave me. As a child of an immigrant, you kind of just like want to owe back your parents everything and you feel like I don't know, I feel like I could work for the rest of my life and do like pay for everything, do everything for my parents but I feel like it would just never be enough. It's just like something that's just engraved in you forever because yeah, like I said, just seeing my mom work like literally seven days a week. Seven days a week guys, isn't that just crazy? So I just printed out photos of where we're staying and then maybe I'll just like stick it in the card or something. I'm just gonna like cover all the details <laughs> but I made like a little boarding pass on Canva. So that's like something really cute. She doesn't know I've booked it yet though so it'll still be a little bit of a surprise. So my mom doesn't read English, so I'm gonna translate what's written already in here and translate what I want to say as well. Um, so I gotta go to Google Translate and translate everything into Mandarin. I did go to Chinese school when I was young for like years, years, but I don't remember anything. I think I can listen better, but I can't really write. And I think with speaking, I think I'm just shy to speak because maybe my pronunciation is wrong, so I don't. while since I put in my second and third piercing just because I'm lazy but I feel like I shouldn't be lazy because it just looks so good everything is Ana Luisa and I also got Joan Day's ear cuff her collaboration with Ana Luisa and it comes in silver and gold so obviously I'm gonna wear the gold let's get this in I mean that's quite cute right I actually wanted to get a piercing about here like in the middle of my ear but maybe I'll just wear this ear cuff. It's super, super cute. And then on this side, this is what it looks like. This is just my go-to stack. So this is the Cassie Pearl, the mini organic pearl. I think this one's the Ashley. And then this is the Freda. And then this one's Joan Day's ear cuff. Super cute. Today is an errand day. I got some things that I need to pick up, I need to do. And then a Costco is opening up in New Zealand. It's the first Costco. Does that sound crazy to you guys that we're only getting a Costco now here in New Zealand? But yeah, it's finally happening. It's not officially open, but you can go in and get your membership. I'm sorry I keep looking away. I just don't know how it got so gloomy this quick. Like if I didn't have this light, Anyway, and then our friends recently got their own place and we're gonna go visit them. I do have an update for the weekly vlogs. So the weekly vlog style is going to be taking a break. You could say that season one has came to an end and there's gonna be a short hiatus and then I'll be back with a season two. Um, but there will still be like a vlog going up during this slot, Sunday, 9 a.m. PST. I will be uploading like my solo dates. So next week you'll see my perfume solo date, like that whole video. And then the following week I have like a self-care video that I wanna do. And then the other following week will be a different kind of solo date that I have planned. So I think for the next three to four weeks I have a different type of vlog that I want to upload during the slot and I thought that could be a good way to take a little break from vlogging almost every day. Um, I think that's just healthy. So this kind of style where you see like my everyday life, um, we're gonna take a pause on that for now. I'll be back, but yeah. Did you guys see that? I want to go out today? Oh. Okay, anyway. 
I should probably leave now. But do I want to leave? right there and then so that's my photo oh it's so nice have you seen my new camera <laughs> Oh, yeah, I'm gonna have it. 